Hey, it's Mark Weens here today in Bangkok, Thailand. Going to be making a Thai street food recipe today. Pad Gapau Gai Kai Dao. And that is holy basil with chicken and a fried egg on the side all over a bed of hot rice. It's a delicious, awesome Thai dish. Stay tuned. I'm going to share the recipe with you right now. fry the eggs first so they're all ready to go. Put my, put my pan over. Uh, thai eggs are actually not just fried eggs but they're deep fried eggs so you do use quite a bit of oil. You want to make sure the oil is very hot uh, before you put in the egg. Actually you don't want to flip the egg so what you want to do is just grab some of the oil and keep like putting it over the over the egg. Oh yeah, that is a nice Thai style deep fried egg right there. You want to set the egg aside. We're going to be using one chicken breast for this recipe. Alright, the first thing you want to do is take your chicken and slice it into nice bite-sized pieces. Chicken aside, we're now going to cut up the chilies and garlic and I'm going to put, I think about, how about about four four chilies, but of course you can use as many chilies or as little as you like. The normal Thai Thai chilies. Garlic, again, you can use as many or as little as you like, but I am again a garlic fanatic. I think we're gonna go with four cloves. Now, I think the easiest way to cut garlic is to first slice off both of the ends of the clove and then give it a quick smash with the side of your knife. And that way, you can see the garlic just, the skin just peels right off. You don't need to get it too fine. You just want to kind of bring out those oils of the garlic and chilies. So that should just about be good right there. Final preparation, gonna take the holy basil leaves off the stock and you just kind of pluck the leaf, get a good bunch of holy basil because that is the awesome flavor of this entire dish. All right. This time make sure it's a really high heat and pour in about one tablespoon or so of oil. Swirl that oil around for just a few seconds, uh, and once it's really hot, you can toss in the garlic and chilies. Stir fry that for just a few seconds, and then you can toss in your chicken. Uh, and you wanna stir fry that chicken continuously for about a minute or so, and then you can add the light soy sauce, spoon of oyster sauce, a tiny bit of sugar, and lastly, a squirt of dark soy sauce. And if it gets a little bit dry, you can add a little bit of water in there. Final step. <laughs> I like a big handful of holy basil. As soon as you add that basil, you want to turn off the heat, but keep stirring. This is extremely important because you don't want to overcook that basil, which would make it lose its flavor. Put that right over the rice, and then that egg that we fried before, lay that right. The only reason I cook is, of course, to eat, so it's hot and fresh. Mm. Oh, that's delicious. It's spicy and garlicky, and you got that awesome peppery sensation from the, from the holy basil. I overcooked it a little bit, unfortunately, but that's all right. I like it a little runnier, and another bite. That extra creaminess from the egg yolk, yeah, that's where it's at right there. That is. Mm. All right, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this quick recipe and be sure to leave a comment below and also give it a quick thumbs up and happy cooking.